Hello everyone and welcome to Sketch It Out Thursday. Here's the layout I created. These photos I've had lying around for a while, seeing as in them Sam is only 11 and he's now 17. And they've been calling to me for a long time but I really didn't know how to scrapbook them. Seeing as they're so green and it's not very often you get anything with sushi on it. But I found this layout on Pinterest and for some reason it spoke to me for this layout or for these photos and so I dove into my stash and I found this stencil it's a studio calico stencil that I've had for quite some time and I got out some distress ink and just colored away I started with shabby shutters I think no twisted citron and I did a quick layer of that and then went over with some mode lawn to give a bit of emphasis to the right hand side of each ray. As you can see, it's a little bit larger than the piece of paper. Oh, no, the paper's a little bit larger, and I just, I'm going to trim it down. But first, I splattered some water on it to lift some of the colours and just give it a bit of interest. I quite like doing this with Distress Ink because it is water reactive, it does give a nice effect. Anyway, you can see here I'm trimming it down. I did have a bit of trouble finding pattern paper to go with this layout. I actually went through quite a lot of my stash, and luckily I didn't record that for you. But I found this page out of the Girl Squad range from Pebbles. And I quite like the olive green colour. I felt it picked up the darker green on Sam's sushi costume. Anyway, I matted them on a bit of the paper that I had gutted out of the centre and then I don't know why but I thought hmm I haven't used washi tape in a long time. I know in the original layout there was layers of paper on the rays and I did think some washi tape tape will give it a little bit of extra effect. So I ripped pieces in half and just laid them on the left hand side of the rays and I was quite happy with it actually when I finished. In real life it is quite effective. What you can't see very well though in the video is that I did take it to my sewing machine and I sewed along each piece of the washi tape. Mm, it, I'm quite impressed with it really, I really like it. And then I splattered on some Lindy Stamp Gang. It's called Frolic in the Forest Black. Then I took it back to the sewing machine after I had used my double sape, double sape, double sided tape method to stick it down to that gutted piece of patterned paper. And I just sewed a rectangle, no, square, all the way around, just for a little bit of interest. I added some tissue paper behind the photos, mainly because I didn't really want to pull in another piece of patterned paper, but I just wanted something extra. Got out some fun foam, and then I went through all my embellishments looking for something that I could use with this layout. And I happened to find all these old pieces from a Kaiser, Kaiser, I don't really know how you say it, that, um, craft ranger back to school range from a few years ago but I've just felt that the little pops of red and yellow actually went in with the the red on Harry's costume and the bit of orange in Sam's t-shirt behind his sushi costume. I also got some thread out when I organized where I wanted it I pulled off the whole piece of the photos. I glued them or double sided tape, tape them to the back of the photos in the foam before because I had it all arranged and I just didn't want to mess that up and try and get it right so there you can see I'm just adjusting it looking at it going yep quite like it and I, in my mind I had thought about using stars and having the title something to do about superstars or parade day superstars I ended up with Asia week superstars we have this celebration at school where we focus in on because we the children learn Indonesian, we celebrate Asia Week. And one part of that is a dress-up day. 
and so you have to come dressed up something to do with some Asian culture and as you can see Sam was a sushi and Harry was a sumo wrestler and so because I wanted that su that superstar word and I was really impressed I found a sticker from that range that said superstar I pulled out some little wooden uh, studio calico stars and glued them on as well did a little tiny bit of typing which says Sam and Harry had a great time hamming it up during the Asia Week Parade. And that's it. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it and inspired to go and have a go yourself with this layout, with this sketch. That's it for now. See you later.